Hi guys, welcome to A Course in Miracles, and here's Ellie. Right, Ellie hasn't been on for a while. <laughs> and we're on lesson 147 today, Ellie. And if I defend myself, I will be attacked. It's a review. And sickness is sickness is a defense against the truth. So what do you think about it? What do you think about it, eh, Els? Elsie, look at the camera. <laughs> She's not bothered, guys. She's not bothered. She's got all the answers. Here she comes. If I defend myself, I am attacked. <laughs> Basically, it means that if you are in a vibration, well, to me, if you're in the vibration of having a fight with someone, or finding fault in someone, or, you know, if you're in that vibration of negativity, then that's what you're going to attract. If I defend myself, I'll be attacked, basically. Because when you're, defense, you're in um, a defense mode, it means you're angry, you're negative, you're carrying the world on your shoulders. As you can see, Ellie just wants to play. Look at her. She just wants to play at the moment. Look! Look, you see, easy peasy. <laughs> Just showing you what an easy peasy way of life is. This is someone that is not defending herself and therefore she's not being attacked. She just trusts me, look. Just look, look, isn't that lovely? She's washing my hands. <laughs> this is a silly lesson. I'm just wearing this thing at the moment because it's helping my shoulder. Um, so anyway, ah, if I defend myself, I hope it doesn't go upside down like it did yesterday. I don't know why it did that. Uh, getting back to the lesson, if I defend myself, I'm attacked. Now let me get comfortable here. There you go. Okay, so now I'm more comfortable. I can um, do the lesson. So if I defend myself, I'm attacked. So again, um... The way I see this lesson is if you're in a space of negativity and you want to fight, you know, your vibration is negative, then that's all you're going to you're going to attract, aren't you? You're going to be attacked if you're uh, in that vibration because you can only attract what you're in, the vibration you're in. So basically, um, don't be defense. Be prepared to discuss things, to find the bit in the middle to find the grey bit rather than worrying about what's too black and too white. Okay, so that's how I see that. Um, and sickness is a defense against the truth. Well, that's obvious, isn't it? Um, basically, what it's saying is you're hiding. The truth is that we can't be sick. The truth is that we are well. The truth is that um, we are pure love and pure love cannot end and cannot get sick it's not the body but sickness is a defense against the truth is what are you hiding so if i'm not well i'm hiding behind this in some way it's serving a purpose of some way it's the ego it's covered up this um amazing creative spirit that can heal anything so sickness is a defense against the truth and that's why people like Myrtle Fillmore and Louise Hay were able to heal themselves because they were able to get in touch with that part of them that was pure love pure truth everything that we really are and the minute they did that of course they healed the body healed but if you're not happy about something then the ego will play up and then it can cause dis-ease in the body and so I'm just going to read you the little the message for today from the little book. Today is the 28th of May. And let me read it to you. Um, it's hard to believe that self-discipline, this is about self-discipline. Now, if you have self-discipline, then you're not going to be defending yourself. Uh, and you're not going to get attacked because you're going to be in that space of love, keeping yourself in that space of keeping your cool and rolling with the punches, so to speak. Okay, so it makes perfect sense. That's from the little book of the today as well. So um, I'm a bit all over the place at the moment, but I'm trying to say is that 
when you get a situation that is not pure love and you know it could cause a row or it could cause a war, you know, so to speak, then roll with it, breathe deeply, don't keep pushing it, don't stir it, walk away from it and let the situation diffuse itself because if you keep defending yourself then you will be attacked because you're in that vibration of come on give it to me give it to me do you see what i mean so i hope that helps i hope this lesson helps and of course the second part um sickness is a defense against the truth it means that if you're not well and if you've got recurring chronic diseases like i have for example then something's not right in your life. You're not happy about something. Your body can only follow your thoughts and your mind. So you need to figure out what's going on inside you that's causing this. And um, really, because disease is dis-ease of some kind. Dis-ease of some kind. That's it. Okay? So that's what it's saying to us. Anyway... I hope I got that through today. Have a beautiful day. And let's say goodbye to Ellie. Ellie, say goodbye. Hey, oh, there she is. Say goodbye, beautiful. <laughs> say goodbye. Bye-bye. Yeah, that's all she does. Purr, purr, purr. Take care. Bye.